Hello, this is George Sender, the guy from Pittsburgh, and I took down the little bag off the wall because it was covered in dust. i got to climb up here on the footstool, but I'll wait till Kathy comes here. But the reason I'm doing this video in the living room, with no reflectix except in one window, it is four degrees hotter in here, 82, than in the bedroom, and it's roughly 4.10 p.m. Here's the little fuzzy. Fuzzy. So what I will do today, now that little girl has been let outside, she was in all night, or all morning actually, I will go and put the ref crawl back there after I move this stuff and put the reflexix in that window where a great deal of heat comes through. It will cut up my light, but that's okay. I'll be glad when these two lamps, the one in here, and the one in the bedroom repaired, and I went with a broom and got up all the cobwebs I could find. So, it's still warm, it's in this corner. Now I have this fan on low, and this fan is on. This, and all the rest of them are off, and this fan is on. So, I think when I put the reflectix in that window, and I have not done anything in the kitchen uh, because it's just been too hot, but uh, I think when I put the reflectix in that window, the temperature in this room might get down to below 80 because that's where a lot of the heat hits the window. Now, of course, I can't do anything about the heat hitting the walls, and uh, the laundry you see needs to be washed. Next week, <laughs> next week, I stirred up a lot of dust. So, we shall see what we shall see, and hopefully, it will cool off in here as well. It's rather warm in this corner, and by next week, I'm going to get a shopping cart and take all this laundry down and wash it, put it away, and take the laundry up to there and put it away. I just would come home and peel my clothes off and throw it wherever and don't want to keep using clean clothes when I go out to feed the cats because they just get all sweaty again. Alright, I'm going to um, go see if I can move some stuff in the bedroom and uh, <clears throat> see about doing a video in there tonight. It feels comfortable enough in there, excuse me, <clears throat> that maybe I can do a live video. We will see. I'll have to make room on the table for the MacBook. And uh, no alien head back there because I'm not up to moving. And it's very hot in this corner. I'm sweating. If I can go back there where it's five, four to five degrees cooler and maybe by seven o'clock and or it will be even cooler again well, so much the better what I really need is a second fan in there again and uh, I hope that I won't have to run the portable air conditioner because that drives my electric bill up something fierce but it does cool off the room when it's 80 or below when it's above 80 the air conditioner can't handle the heat all right, this is George Senda, the guy from Pittsburgh. Have a great afternoon, a great evening. Stay warm, wet, dry, or cool out there as the case may be, and stay safe. And I'll go live at 7 or 8 o'clock tonight, depending on how hot it is outside when I go feed the cats. Have a great evening, and uh, I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye for now.